Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 20th of September 1066, Harald Hardrada, the Viking king, defeated his northern English enemies at the Battle of Fulford. The defeat of Harold Godwinson's northern earls was disastrous for the new English king, and he was forced to rush north and take on Hardrada himself, which in turn contributed to Godwinson's later defeat, just a month later, at Hastings to William of Normandy. The origins of Hardrada's invasion of England lie in the conflicting claims to the throne after the death of Edward the Confessor. As one of the claimants, Hardrada had allied himself with Harold Godwinson's banished brother Tostig. After being blown across the North Sea by the very winds that famously left William's fleet stuck on the Normandy coast, Hardrada met up with Tostig's forces and together they made their way to the city of York. The battlefield at Fulford, just outside the city, was largely flat marshland and was hardly an ideal place for armed combat. However, the English took advantage of the River Ouse and the marshier ground to arrange their troops in such a way as to secure their flanks from the outset. Despite this, the fierce fighting that initially saw the Norwegians being driven back gave way to a counter-attack that led to Hardrada's victory. The victors made their way to the city of York, which surrendered on condition that the city wasn't forcibly entered by the troops. Hardrada therefore set up camp at Stamford Bridge, and it was here that he was surprised by Harold Godwinson and his army just five days later. Despite Harold's victory here, however, defeat at Fulford had depleted the English army. This had a major impact on William the Conqueror's successful invasion that occurred just a few weeks later. <laughs> 